We're not going to sit down on our butts. We're going to get up a little bit tall. We're going to take our throwing hand. Back up, buddy. We're going to take our throwing hand and put it right behind our back. We're going to take our glove hand and we're going to work on catching that ball out in front of us. I call this a windshield wiper drill because my arm is going to look like a windshield wiper out in front. A lot of players, when that ball is thrown or hit at them, what do they do? They do this. And it's going to hit the heel of their glove, either hit them in the nose or they're going to miss it. So we got to make sure we practice bare hands. You can do this at home. Practice bare hands so that when you get a glove on your hand, it's that much easier. Whenever we catch a fly ball, anything between our shoulders, we're going to use two hands. Thumb to thumb, pinky to pinky. Good. Four, six, seven. Good try. Yeah, boy. Six. I got it. Three. I got it. Five. I got it. Four. I got it. I got it. Two. Seven. When I say go, we're going to open up with our right leg and push off and start running. Run like your glove is part of your hand. I've seen every group so far, they run like this with a five ball. If I'm running in a race, am I going to run like this? No, I'm going to run like this. Run like the glove is part of your hand and then reach for it. Go. Reach. Not bad. Keep those fingers up. Keep those fingers up. this way. Drop step. Go. Right, th this isn't very athletic. This is tough to do. So we gotta make sure one hand outside our body, two hands inside our body. And you're gonna learn that right now when you're fielding ground balls. In between your feet, in between my shoulders, I can transfer and get it out of two. Outside just one. Make sense?